What's going on everybody? Today I'm uh, doing a little video on fixing a throttle cable on my rat bike here. Uh, I was at my buddy's house and we were doing a little bit of mudding and we went. We were doing a little bit of racing and then I went to hit the throttle and nothing. And so my throttle cable snapped. So today I'm going to show you a little trick on how to make a throttle cable uh, out of a brake cable if you don't have one. Okay, so all you're going to do is you're going to take this end of the brake cable and we're going to come over to the bench grinder. What you want to do, you want to grind this down and get it to match the size of the throttle cable stop. That will allow you to put it in the twist grip. So as you see right here, uh, the new one is on the left and the, the one that I ground down to make work is the one on the right. And you can actually see how much I've actually had to grind off to make this setup work. Okay, and after you do that, put your cable inside your twist grip throttle and set it up like normal. Then you're going to want to unscrew whatever size screw that you have in there. This is what mine looks like. You want to take that out because the outside casing will not fit in there. And once you take that out, you'll be able to shove it back in there. So now taking a look at our throttle linkage right here, we're going to run, a, run it back through this and run it through here and, and clamp it down. But we might have to drill out this hole to make it work because this cable is a lot bigger than a throttle cable. So that's one of the things you may need to do. Okay, now I got it routed through it again. And yeah, so that's pretty much it. So after you do that, you should be home free. So if you like that little tip on how to make a brake cable work as the throttle cable, please like, comment, and subscribe. And I'll try to put out more tips, uh, DOI tips to make shit work.